I am pleased to present to you the evaluation report on the financial assistance provided by the ESM and its predecessor, the EFSF, to Greece from 2012 till the conclusion of the program in 2018. The evaluation covers also the first year after the uh, conclusion of the program. I received the mandate to be the uh, evaluator of the Greek uh, programs from uh, Mr. Centeno, Chairman of the Board of Governors of the ESM, on behalf of the ministers of the Euro area, finance ministers of the Euro area. I uh, worked with uh, a team provided by the ESM. Uh, myself and the team, we carried out uh, more than 100 interviews, both in Greece and outside, in, the, in other countries in the Euro area. And we asked also some background papers. The evaluation task is uh, very important always, but in particular in this case, given the huge efforts provided by the ESM and the other institutions, and on the other hand, the big efforts of the Greek authorities and society to comply with the conditions of the program. After the evaluation, after the, at the end of the report, I uh, put forward my own recommendations for the future, trying to obtain lessons learned during these years and trying to help in the future programs that the ESM will be responsible for. First, I recommend that the uh, programs should be based on a strategic definition of the objectives. Uh, without a long-term view, it's very difficult to be successful in short-term adjustments or reforms. Second recommendation, the program should be uh, adequately designed uh, meaning, among other things, that the conditions under which the program uh, uh, resources will be transferred to the country beneficiary of a program, these conditions should be focused, realistic, and uh, aligned with the objectives to be pursued. Third recommendation, the efforts requested to the country beneficiary of this uh, uh, financing should be fair. The distribution of efforts cannot uh, punish a particular sector of a society or a particular sector of the economy. These uh, efforts should be commensurate to the objectives defining the program and to the uh, achievements that we want to obtain at the end of the program execution. For a recommendation, we need to better coordinate our actions to provide a sustainable achievement. So the results obtained thanks to the implementation of the program should be valid the first day after the conclusion, but also in the coming years after the conclusion, given that the debt obligation of the beneficiary country will take longer to be paid back. And finally, I recommend a very good cooperation between the ESM and the European Commission that is responsible for the coordination of economic policies in the EU and in the Euro area. And this cooperation, based on the respective responsibilities of both institutions, should be uh, the necessary condition for a successful implementation of the program. These are my main recommendations, and I hope this will be useful for the future to adopt uh, uh, coherent programs, successful programs, and uh, viable programs for the future countries that will be under this situation. Thank you very much. By the way, this uh, report will be available for all those who are interested in reading these uh, 120 pages in the website of the ESM.